welcome back to the channel it's your girl Courtney Janine and I'm back with another video today's video is another wig review thank you so much to Sam's Beauty for sending me today's unit today I will be trying out another unit from the Dashley headband unit collection from sensational today I have HB unit number two I have tried HB unit number one so definitely check out that review if you haven't seen it already on my channel this collection is an affordable um headband unit collection so if you are not in the market to spend like a hundred dollars on a headband unit you can definitely try one of these I also have reviews on the crescent collection from janet collection if you're interested in that before we start let's go ahead and touch on the product details in case you haven't seen my other review if you haven't though babe check out my channel get the tea but i got you guys in case you did not see my review and you want to know about the product details it comes with a comfortable and breathable headband attached the headband is with velcro similar to human hair wig units you guys know that i always talk about the janet collection crescent headband collection because it comes with like a 360 headband which i really like because then i don't have to see like the headband and the velcro attached in the back of my head the headband is made with cool fit fabric that actively pulls heat from your scalp the cap size can be adjusted to fit various head sizes because it does have like that jawstring to make it adjustable. Combs for extra security. There's one at the top of the cap and two on the side and one in the back. And then it's functional yet chic and comfy style. You can make it more chic by adding your own headband and it's a great protective style for any occasion. I also like how the stock card comes with a how to install section so it tells you exactly how to install the unit. Um, and how easy it is. It's just three steps. So I'm gonna go ahead and open this unit up. This one is different than the first unit that I reviewed because it's a more curly texture. So I'm super excited about this. I'm just gonna open it up. We already kind of touched on the cap construction. So I will just show you guys the inside of the cap and we will move right along into um, trying her on and installing her. So here is the completed look of Miss HB Unit 2. I am kind of obsessed. I think it's super cute. I didn't think that I would like it this much. I don't know. It's definitely fuller in person. Like if you look at this stock card, let me pull it out. If you look at this stock card, it is definitely giving a little bit more, not as like full, like not as, um, I don't know. It's not as big as. I feel like it is on my head or maybe I have a small head I don't know but this is super cute I can definitely see this getting even more realistic as you wear her more and more this actually just I feel like maybe suits my face a little bit more even though the Dashley headband unit number one was super cute too but I feel like this is just like oh yeah this is her hair like I don't know, I think it just looks a little bit more natural on my face. Let me know down below if you've seen both reviews, which one do you prefer better? I think I like this one, especially if I just cut right here so it like kind of frames my face a little bit more. I could also see myself just cutting some bangs. Y'all know, I get scissor happy and I will cut some bangs in a unit. All right, you guys, so enough of like me rambling. Let me get into my pros, my cons, and my final thoughts. In terms of cons, it's not really a con. You know, I like to give like warnings where it's not like a con but i feel like you should be aware of it so i just think that this unit looks a lot fuller in person so if you're not a, a fan of big hair now it's not on kinky 22 big hair but it is big hair and it's very full and it will kind of swallow your face if you're not <laughs> ready for it so just be aware of that that is kind of like my only caution with this unit in terms of pros i love the curly texture i think that this is a unit that will 
um, aged well because of just like the nature of the unit. Like me just fluffing it a little bit makes it look even more natural. It does, I don't think it has a sheen to it. It might look a little bit, no, I think it looks fine. What else would I say? I wish that it had a little bit more layers in it because I feel like the Dashley Headband HB Unit 1 had layers in it already cut. It was a straight unit, but I wish that this one had a little bit more layers to it too, just so it frames our face as soon as we open it out of the pack. But you can definitely customize it yourself, which I think I'm gonna do so that it fits my face. Another pro. Yeah, I just love the texture of this unit. In terms of like my overall final thoughts, it's similar to my thoughts about all headband units. I think that this is one, a great unit for the price, especially because this is one of the few units that I feel like will look better as it gets older. So you can wear it more and more or time and time again and it will still look good or look even better. I think also that this is a unit I would do more so for my like, like my errands because it does, it's giving me my hair um, like, who gonna clock me? Especially if I put like my own headband on. Perp. Um, or if I had like long enough hair so that you could, I could like swoop some baby hairs or something. Oh yeah, it would be a look. But yeah, you guys, let me know your thoughts on this. Have you tried a Dashley headband unit? Let me know in the comments. I definitely think it's worth the money because it isn't like that $20, $30 range. So it's definitely cheaper than um, one of the human hair wigs. Thank you again to Sam's Beauty for sending me this unit. Let me know your thoughts on this unit down in the comments and I'll see you guys in my next one.